Hello, my friends. Thank you very much for subscribing to our channel. There are 27 balls, and they all look the same. Except for a fake one. All the other 26 balls also have the same weight. With one balance. How many times does it take to find the fake one which has the different weight than the others? Why not give a try, and we will come back soon. In step 1. We randomly choose two groups of 9 balls each, and place them on the balance. If the weights of the two groups are different, we will know that the fake one must be in either of the groups. So we go ahead to the second step. By replacing either of the previously selected group with the remaining 9 balls. For instance, we say, the lighter group is replaced. At this time, if the weights of the current two groups are still different, the fake one must be in the group that has not been replaced. More importantly, we also learn that the fake one is heavier than others. Then we go ahead to the third step, which is randomly choosing two groups of three balls from the nine balls containing the fake one, and place them back on the balance again. If they have different weights, the fake one must be in the heavier group. If they have the same weight, the fake one is one of the remaining three balls. Then we go to the fourth step. From the three balls containing the fake one, we randomly choose two to place back on the balance. If their weights are different, the heavier one is the fake one. If the weights are the same, the remaining one is the fake one. In this series of possible cases, four steps are enough to determine which one is fake. Now let's go back to step two. If the weights on both sides of the balance are the same after replacing the lighter group with the remaining nine balls, the fake one must be one of the nine that have been replaced. And we learn that, the fake one is lighter than others. By using a similar approach, we will choose two groups of three balls to determine which of the three balls include the fake one. And then choose two of determined three to further determine which one is fake. Finally, there are also four steps to complete the task. If, after the first attempt, the weights on both sides of the balance are equal, the fake ball must be one of the nine balls that haven't been selected. Then in step two, we have to choose two groups of three balls among these nine balls. If they don't have the same weight, we go to step three, and replace the lighter group with the remaining three balls. In the same way as the nine balls case, if the weights of the two groups are still unequal, the fake is in the heavier group. And if the two weights are equal, the fake one is in the lighter group. More importantly, we can also learn whether the fake ball is heavier or lighter than the others. In step 4, we randomly choose two balls and use the same method as before to determine which the fake one is. If in the second step, the weights of the two groups are still the same, the fake one is in the third group. We go to step 3, and weigh any two of the three balls. If their weights are the same, the rest is the fake one. If the two weights are different, we replace the lighter one with the rest. If the weights are still different, the heavier one is fake. And if the weights are the same, the lighter one that is replaced is fake. In any case, waiting the balls for four times is always enough to find the fake one. Thank you for watching, and see you next time.